Hello, welcome to the Nine News Highlights. I am Magdalene Okwedija. President Mohamed Buhari and visiting French President Emmanuel Macron have held bilateral talks bordering on security and terrorism as well as strengthening of relations between both countries. The French leader and members of his entourage arrived at the presidential villa by 4.35 p.m. and were received by President Buhari, Governor Ibikunda Mosun of Ogun State, cabinet members and some presidential aides. Both presidents agreed to work together to ensure a more cordial relationship to fast-track development in their countries. The French leader will, after his engagement with Buhari, visit the Africa Shrine, a nightclub in Lagos founded by Nigerian music legend Fela Anikulak Makuti. The Ministry of Health has launched three key reproductive health documents to aid choices in birth control and combat high rate of maternal mortality in Nigeria. The documents launched are the National DMPA Introduction and Scale-Up Strategy Plan 2018, the National Guidelines on Safe Termination of Pregnancy for Legal Indications and Global Family Planning Visibility and Analytic Network and the National Logistics Management Information Systems. Ivago Global, an investment company, has concluded plans to hold a three-day conference tagged Arise Africa in Abuja with no fewer than 300 international investors participating. Mr. Evans Usamuge, Chief Executive Officer of the company said the conference will focus on providing impact investments, increased industrial machinery and knowledge transfer to help create skilled local jobs, businesses and strong institutional capital structure for Africa. A 15-year-old former Boko Haram bomb maker has confessed to making over 500 underwear improvised explosive devices used by insurgents for suicide missions on soft targets in the last five years. Ali Goni, who made the chilling confession to the army, was only 10 years old and in primary six when he was kidnapped in Burma and has been described by army intelligence sources as the most innovative bomb maker to emerge in recent years. The police on Tuesday arrested a British female healthcare worker on suspicion of murdering eight babies and trying to murder six others. The arrest followed an inquiry into the deaths of 17 babies and 15 non-fatal collapses between March 2015 and July 2016 at the Countess of Chester Hospital's new natal unit in Northern England. For details of these and other stories, do log on to our website, nan.ng.